I think the industry has moved a lot in the last five years. Um, we've seen a lot of uh, technical achievements, both on platforms and within games in general. Um, so for Absolution, it's been it's been uh, really, really interesting to follow that around because the game has been in development, development for some time now. And uh, for us to be able to uh, to follow up on the bar that's been set really, really high from, uh, for, you know, from a lot of the games is uh, is tough, but it's also a really, really interesting challenge for us. Instincts is a new feature for Absolution. Uh, it's never been in any of the Hitman games before. Um, it came about because we wanted to have a feature in there that really allowed the player to understand what the game was about um, in terms of all the messaging that's been sent from the game to the player. Um, in previous games, you would often be in a situation where you weren't entirely sure what had happened, what the AI was doing, um, why a certain uh, situation would escalate. And with Instincts, you're in a much better place in, in terms of trying to find out why is the, the game reacting to you in the way that it does. So we've included checkpoints into uh, Absolution because we felt it was a good match with the general feel we wanted to have for the game. So the idea this time around is to create a lot more interesting situations for the player where we can push him a little bit more, have things closer. Um, in, in the previous games, the levels were extremely large, and that meant that if you had a situation where you would engage people and um, the situation would go badly for you, um, that would alert the entire level. Now with checkpoints, that's kind of different. Um, you only alert a certain uh, radius, um, and if you can contain that situation, then uh, you will be okay. And for that reason, we're trying to see if we can actually move away from the trial and error gameplay of the previous games and into a kind of territory where it's more easy for the player to, uh, to control the situation. Um, and checkpoints help us do that. In terms of achievements, I think we have a lot of really, really cool stuff in there. Um, there's some, there's some smaller stuff for the guys who, who just want to get in and feel around and get some, uh, some instant gratification. But we have some really, really core features that if you want to gain a thousand gamer points out of this thing, you will have to work really hard. You'll absolutely be able to move through levels without killing anyone, um, apart from the targets that you've been designated. Um, that's a key feature of Hitman, it's always been that, and uh, we're obviously retaining that for this time around.